Welcome to Kingdom Stuff, where we talk about the Kingdom of God and doing like Jesus. Well, another testimony I have of uh, while we were at um, a church in Chaloma, a large church of maybe 700 people, it came time for uh, prayer after we did our worship and proclaiming the good news. And as we're getting ready to pray, I sensed prior that the Lord said to me that somebody there uh, needed prayer for injuries or pain related to a motorcycle accident. And I thought, that's crazy, Lord. I mean, there's so many people here riding motorcycles. That's that's like too easy. And um, I wasn't going to say anything, but I kept feeling God's nudge. So I said, all right, all right. So I gave uh, the word that I've sensed God saying there was somebody there that had a motorcycle accident that needed prayer. And I'm waiting and waiting and waiting and nobody's coming forward. And I'm thinking, oh, my goodness, I'm going to look like a fool. But we waited. I said, I believe God said there was somebody. And I saw some ladies walking on in the aisle on the side next to the wall coming forward and as I said that, I said, I, I believe there is somebody here. Two women raised their hands as they were walking forward, and they came forward. And it was actually three women that had um, actually been in a motorcycle accident. And the one woman said that she had this accident 40 years ago and had been in pain ever since. Well, we prayed for her, commanded the pain to leave, broke off all the effects all the uh, from the accident you know, like we normally do, invite God's kingdom to come, his rule and reign in their bodies. And she said the pain left for the first time in 40 years. So pretty amazing. And I had to repent and say, Lord, forgive me for not trusting you and not believing. I just didn't think in my mind that that was uh, something that would be legitimate. But God knew different. If you enjoyed this briefing, subscribe here. Check out... Uh, my book Kingdom Stuff on Amazon or our website kingdomstuff.org and we'll see you tomorrow.